So my beautiful people, I am back with another Hour and Ring video and today I showcase to you guys how you can get, well, what's an extremely rare weapon? I mean, one enemy drops this, I know yes, there's many one enemy weapons in this game, but this one is an enemy hiding in a dark corner in a place you probably won't go to, you don't have to go there, and I mean, literally it's a one time thing, so hey, and it's pretty cool too, it's called the Mantis Blade and today I'll explain all. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leave a like, it really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so there are many rare weapons in the game. There are many weapons you will easily miss and this is probably top of the charts. I mean, this drops from one enemy, as far as I'm aware, there's only one of these enemies in this game uh, that I've seen anyway. And this enemy is hiding literally in a dark corner. You can easily miss or because at the time you will encounter this enemy it's kind of like yep yeah, i'm in a rush i need to get out of here i don't want i don't have time to stand here and fight just in case so yeah guys it's a it's a great weapon too like i said i'll showcase it to you now it actually is it, super unique in its heavy attack but first let's check out its stats uh, it scales with strength and dexterity it requires 12 uh, dexterity and 10 strength can apply an actual ward to it it's just got that standard spinny slashy thing i hate seeing this on that weapon i'm not gonna lie i'm sort of used to weapons with unique skills but hey this one guys you can apply an actual ward to it to make it even better and it's, as you can see by its heavy attack it kind of like doubles up like a mantis claw pretty cool guys it really is pretty cool but hey you're wielding these things i mean new game plus only unless you can get somebody to drop it for you or dupe it with you but new game plus only uh, dual wielding this, I think it would be absolutely amazing, I really do. But yeah guys, okay, so where does this come from? So, it drops from an enemy all the way up here, within, where are we? The Galmir's Hero Grave. Now this is quite a trek to get to, you first obviously need uh, access to the Grand Lift of Dectus. Uh, Dectus Medallion guys, search YouTube for it. Um, easy to get once you have access to this you can come you can actually make your way around here now I ain't gonna run all the way around because this video will be 20 minutes long but the easiest path to is too easy just literally just, just follow this just follow this guy just run around here run straight up through here just like so you'll come around here then guys and you'll come to this grace point now I'll lead you from this grace point which you'll see on the screen now uh, but you literally run forward come up a ladder and just follow the path I take. And once you're in the hero's grave, it may take a few attempts because it can be a bit hard. There's a chariot in there, there's lava, there's all kinds of things. I take a different route to probably a route many people will take. I jump down on the second uh, sequence of the chariot. I jump down onto like a little ledge and then just go away back route and I actually land on top of where this enemy is you need to kill. But hey guys, follow what I do. Seeing where I'm going on screen now and you shouldn't have no problem getting this thing. Like I said, once you get to the hero's grave, just take your time in there. It's a little dangerous. That chariot is absolutely disgracefully powerful. One hit, guys, and it destroys you. But yes, go get this weapon, guys. I'm pretty sure you will love it. And well, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did leave it a like, it really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more out of the ring, be sure to subscribe and hopefully it might be beautiful, people. I will see you on that next one.